praise the lord hallelujah god bless you so much for always watching so let's just go ahead we're going to read the book of um second chronicles chapter 33 verse 7 it says and he set a caved image the idol which he had made in the house of god of which god had said to david and to solomon his son in this house in jerusalem which i have chosen before all tribe of israel will i put my name forever that is where manessa have a mind to go and put graven image like it was just provoking god to anger verse 8 says neither will i anymore remove the fruits of israel from out of the land which i have appointed for your father so that they would take it to do all that i have commanded them according to the old law and statutes and ordinances by the hand of moses so many some made judah and inhabitants of jerusalem to err and to do worse than the earthing whom the lord had destroyed before the children of israel many some influence the people badly so if uh, anyone that you have that you are watching that is influencing you you should try to watch out if it's positively or negatively the lord will help us verse 11 says wherefore the lord brought upon them the captains of the host of the king of assyria which took manessa among the thorns and burned him with fetters and carried him to babylon hmm, may we never be carried to babylon before we realize our mistake in jesus name amen verse 12 says and when he was in affliction he besought the lord his god and humbled himself greatly before god of his father i don't know who you are watching this video but i want you to know that our god is god that answered by fire humble yourself come to him don't wait till you get afflicted tell him father i'm sorry i repent for all i've done and i believe your son as my savior my personal savior when you get close to your father you see that every other challenges every other circumstances will just be will just be coming out of it like you know he said he would deliver us from every form of pestilence every form of the captivity of the enemy our god has promised to deliver us all we have to do is humble ourselves remember the menace menace did not humble himself before and affliction came on him then he had no choice but to humble himself may we not be humbled by force in jesus name amen god bless you so much for always watching share subscribe let someone else come to the knowledge of your father of how loving and caring he is and how he's longing to take good care of us god bless you